All right, guys, this is how much I love you. I pulled the bike out in the snow so I can show you the turn signals. Anyhow, I'm gonna do this quick little demo, It'll take about a minute, and then I'm gonna put the bike away inside. There's the right hand turn signal. There's the left hand turn signal. And one of these days I'm gonna do a proper test. And there's both of them flashing. So, um, I'm gonna add the second piece of this video. And just basically give you a quick overview of of what I did. So this is the adapter up close. Just wanted you to see this. To get things started, I cut those little clear plastic sheathings uh, that you see. And in exchange of that, I used actual shrink wrap, which you'll see um, in the next picture. The green wire is for the signal and the orange, the yellow orange -ish wire is for the power. As you can see here, everything's been um, crimped onto those connectors and over it is the pink uh, heat shrink, uh, the shrink wrap uh, that I used to kind of uh, prevent it from coming loose. And then finally, to clean things up, um, I wrapped that with some electrical tape and uh, everything uh, fit right in um, nice and clean everything worked perfectly and um, I like it in my opinion the signals uh, were, were, were decent uh, probably wouldn't see it from really far away but I think you'll see it in the intersection um, which is really what matters so it's better than nothing I'm very satisfied with it in case you guys are wondering um, that's it so hope you enjoyed this quick vid and actually, I've decided to go with a wrap instead of paint for the winglets. Um, I think I'm going to try a chrome reflective uh, wrap uh, and see how that looks, see if it makes them pop. So stay tuned for that. I'm going to order those that wrap probably today, try to get it mounted sometime before the end of next week. So uh, I'll keep you guys posted on overall progress. Hope you enjoyed. Take it easy.